right, here's our final cookout. New Virginia High School Solar Cookout 2 on a Friday, November 15th, 2013. We're going to go outside and check. You're going to unravel the, uh, this wire? Yeah. And you're going to hook the, uh, like whatever object you have to heat up on this. Why don't All right, we make it suspended. suspended. Why don't we hold it? So then you can get underneath it and then heat up the object more. Angle as much of the, 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 the sun's radiant energy to one spot right over here. Okay. And we're, we're trying to make this kind of like angle down. And then the back. So like when the sunlight would hit here, it would reflect, it would go either here, and if we, if we would try to go like over, we put, we would put this somewhere here. So if the sunlight goes here, it would go there, and then maybe like... So we're trying to warm an object right now. Okay. So we're trying to reflect the light at this point. We are cutting up these containers to put them on the back so we're able to bend this in any direction we need to reflect the light into the bottom of the box and on to the beaker. For the beaker, we're going to cover it in black, in black construction paper so that it absorbs more of the heat coming from the radiant energy. Um, these, we attach the reflector onto the glass of the box so we can bend them at any angle we need. And we put tin foil on these sides as well. Now, the welder? Yeah, the tin. There's going to be like this piece of wire skewering through here. We're gonna put like a hot dog on here, and it's gonna get cooked by these things, and then maybe these, and then we're gonna put another one here so we can like cook two hot dogs at one time. And then this part right here in the middle, we don't know what we're gonna do with it yet, but we're figuring that out. For our solar meter, we're gonna make the reflector into like kind of oval shape. So when we put it inside the box over here, I was wondering. We're gonna try to see if the sun hits like around here, so we can like uh, maybe put some like toast or something like this here, so that um, if it works, then we'll have a successful. Damien is trying to work, and Hunter and me are trying to build a solar filter with two sides, which will get radiant energy reflected two angles towards one point in the solar stove thingy. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we are gonna have our solar filter at an angle, and we're gonna make everything in dead, so that it's sort of like an oven, right? So when the sun hits here, it's gonna reflect off of everything besides right here, so it will cause the focal point in the middle. On the outside, we're gonna make it black, so that it gets absorbed, heating the contents of the box. So we're gonna make, like in the oven, we're gonna make crossbars with the hangers. And we're gonna put like a, what's it called? Oh, an oven and like a thing. Yeah, we're gonna put the stove top with aluminum foil and the uh, wind shield protection thing. And then we're going to uh, have uh, parabolic mirrors made with aluminum foil shine, uh, concentrating light onto the beaker. <laughs> What do you got here, Nico? I got a fly. It's turkey. Huh? That's turkey. Chicken hot dogs with turkey. What are those? Sausage. We're going to try to heat up the bun so it can be warm as well with the hot dogs. So we're going to try it today. Pretty cloudy. For our slow cooker project, we're building s'mores and stuff. So we're gonna put them in Ziploc bags and put them out in our grill. And uh, yeah. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Oh, are you still recording? Try to use all these three uh, like uh, panels to reflect the sun onto these uh, two areas. And we use this little um, 
go uh, use of um, the car uh, reflector to try to uh, try to create a focal point on these two uh, pieces. Okay. Cooking turkey smoking. Okay. And so our design is a half oven, half reflector. Okay. So you want to angle it 45 degrees to the sun. And uh, yeah. Oh, we're also covering it up with ceramic wrap. But any extra heat. Hit right here. This is the focal point. We'll shoot heat up our food. This is taped down to the cardboard in order to prevent it from falling off. And then the cardboard is taped down to the bucket, and the bucket has a giant rock to, keep, to have, you know, to even distribute weight so that the window won't knock it over. So why are you doing the extra weight in the bucket this time? Because last time the wind blew our solar cooker over and it fell. We had to restart, and it messed with our experiment. Okay. So we learn from the experience. Yes. Okay. Even a bad experience. What'd you have? Baked bacon. Oh, cooking. Oh, yeah. Bacon. <laughs> Dimitri, how's that food? Thanks. Compliments to the chef. Oh, that was you. <laughs> All right. How warm, guys? Got it good? All right. How we do, Lance? Good. Yeah. We're just um, waiting for Tyler. Okay. Oh, get your um, How was your hot dog? It's really good. What was your temperature you got up to? 50. Okay. It's 120 some Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit? Okay. Good deal. Oh, let me get some more. Oh, my gosh. Emerson. Show me a hot dog. my mess cam right here. Come on, let me see that. Let me see that mess. See that mess. 